Okay, my family, this is our third attempt at trying to get this up. Our sister in Christ has a new video up, Julie Wedby from I am calling you now. Blogspot.com. We are ready to give birth, the remnant. You're in the fire here to be transformed, so that my heart and my perfect love are manifested in a dying and fallen realm. The birth pains come closer and closer now, as we are ready to give birth. You, my holy vessels, the sanctuaries of my spirit, are being prepared to receive my glory. My oil of anointing will fall upon you, igniting a passion and a desire within you. My people, that will illuminate the earth like never before. The labor has been difficult and painful, and the contractions come yet even closer together now, as the darkness is intensified. Allow the fires of your tribulations to empty completely every effect of sin in your lives. As you remove the leaven in your lives, I, the King of Glory, comes in. Nothing you are facing is too difficult for me. Pray intensely and with fervor. Boldly speak my words with great faith and believe in my promises. My words will not return to me void. Enhance the test as I give you opportunities to overcome. I look at your responses along this journey to see my own reflection as your heart's desires and mine are one. Remember always, this is not your home. You are here for my purposes so I may complete the good work I have begun in you. This life is but a vapor, a stepping stone in your walk of intimacy with me. As I move you from glory to glory into eternity, we shall love in each other. This dwelling place shall fall because it is not in harmony with its creator, and I will renew this earth so that I will once again be glorified here. Take heart in that you keep my kingdom perspective in your final moments here, so that this terrible evil will not distract you from the narrow way, or deceive you from hearing only your shepherd's counsel, as the fulfillment of all things comes to pass. Have no fear, I have not forgotten you. On the contrary, you are my jewels, my precious treasures, through which everything I have spoken will be fulfilled. This final stretch appears endless, but I assure you there is an appointed time for me to infuse you completely, and I will not delay in doing this that my Father has ordained for you. I give you my great peace and joy overflowing as the birth is ready to take place. Have gladness in your hearts, my loves. You are loved by the King, Yeshua. Glory to God in the highest. I pray the blood of Jesus over this video and over any and all who are led by the Holy Spirit of God to listen to it. He is with us as we go through our testings and trials, my family. I pray every morning that I might see those people who I meet on my road or on the road that day and I might look at them through his eyes and see them the way he sees them with his mercy, grace, and love that he has for all of his children. When we look at the people who we interact with through his eyes, it is so much easier to let, your, to let his, shine, his light shine forth through you so that we can look at lo- look in love and have pleasant dealings with each and every one who we meet. I pray the blood of Jesus Christ over this message and I pray for a hedge of protection over all of you. Over your homes, your families, your children, your pets, over your places of work and worship over your children's schools and over your vehicles. I pray that he fills you all with his peace, the peace that only Jesus Christ can give. And I pray that all is going well with you. And if it is not, speak forth his promises. Speak forth his promises in faith. Speak love and joy into your life and into your heart and bind those things which are confronting you. We are given great power and authority through Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, to trample upon the serpents and scorpions that are sent our way. No weapon formed against us shall prosper. Greater is he that is in me than he is in the world. He he goes before us and he makes a crooked pathway straight. He shall never leave nor forsake us. He is here with us family, just call on him, and he will be there with you to help. I love you all, and I'm praying for you all. Glory to God in the highest. Amen and amen.